In this video we'll be taking a look at another best gaming motherboard, which is the ASRock A520 MIT Zack. We will compare it against similar and newer gaming motherboards in terms of quality, performance, design, and value for the price. If you want more information and updated pricing on the product mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description down below. Ok, so let's get to the video. AMD's budget Ryzen motherboard chipset, the A520, has largely slipped under the radar. While B350 and B450 motherboards were mostly regarded as being entry-level, A320 was strictly seen as resolutely low-end. The introduction of B550 motherboards, and their associated move upward in price, left a big hole in the sub-$100 market. Enter A520. If you're on a tighter budget, and don't care about C4.0 or the overclocking support offered by B550, then the A520 motherboards might be exactly what you need. There's cheap and there's really cheap, but a decent A520 board can more or less do everything a board at double the price can. Then there's the cherry on top which is support for AMD Ryzen 5000 series CPUs and, almost as importantly, Ryzen 4000 series APUs. Combine a Zen 3 CPU with a motherboard such as this ASRock A520 MITX A.C. And you'll be able to build an affordable and compact system that can beat any Intel chip in any kind of workload. The ASRock A520M's audio is a bit of a letdown but that's something that budget boards often compromise on. A gamer listening to compressed audio assets in-game probably won't be any less immersed. The little ASRock A520 MITX A.C has it where it counts and will serve you well at the heart of a budget gaming system. It benefits from the strengths of the Ryzen platform and adds some future proofing into the mix. ITX fans looking for a capable budget AMD Ryzen option should definitely have this one on their shortlist. Thanks for watching the video. If you find this video helpful please help out the channel by giving this video a like or subscribe the channel and tell us which product caught your eye in the comments below.